Hi, little sprouts. I'm sure you've noticed that leaves don't always look like they're the same color. Sometimes a leaf looks green, but sometimes leaves look yellow, orange, brown, or red. Well, our book today is called Why Do Leaves Change Color? And it's from the collection called A Just Ask Book. And in this book, we're going to learn why leaves change colors. Now, this is a fiction book. I can tell because the little animals are wearing clothes and raking, and that's not something a little mouse would probably be doing. But even though it's a fiction book, it was made to teach us some real information. So the information we learn from this book is true. Why do leaves change colors? The little mouse is telling us, Hi, my name is Christopher. Can you guys say, Hi, Christopher. Look at the leaves. Something has happened. The leaves aren't green anymore. They are changing color. And the worm says, I noticed that too. My leaves were green. Now they are red, yellow, orange, and brown. Hmm, so I see. I wonder why do leaves change colors? And the little groundhog saying, well, I don't know, but I'll bet someone does. Our friend the squirrel lives in a tree. He must know something about leaves. Let's ask him. Hi, squirrel. Can you tell us why do leaves change color? It's rather complicated, but I think I can show you. Try to think back to springtime. That's when the little buds appear on the branches of the trees. Each little bud is the beginning of a new leaf. Here are what buds look like, everybody. They're very small beginning of leaves. The sun warms the bud and the new leaf begins to grow. As the leaf grows, it starts to make its own food. Very interesting. Each leaf is like a tiny food factory. The leaf uses sunlight, things in the air, water, and a green matter called chlorophyll. Can you say that with me? Chlorophyll. So look at this picture, guys. A leaf or a tree cannot go to the grocery store or McDonald's and get food. That's just not how they work. Plants make their own food. So what the squirrel is telling us is that this leaf is a little food factory. And it's taking things from the sun and the air that it breathes and the water from rain and it makes it into food for the tree. As the leaf makes food, the chlorophyll keeps the leaf green and healthy. The leaf also has other colors in it, but the green chlorophyll covers them up. Let me show you. I never knew that. Neither did I. I'll color this leaf, then I'll color over it with green. You see, the green covers up the yellow. So look at that, friends. The leaf is actually yellow. That's its natural color. Leaves can also be orange or red or brown, but the chlorophyll, which is the food that it makes, is green. And the chlorophyll covers up its natural color. This also happens with orange and red. See that? Its natural colors are being colored over by the chlorophyll. And even with light brown. In the leaf, the green chlorophyll covers up the other colors. So we see only green leaves. When the fall season begins, the leaf starts to die. There is less sunlight because the days are shorter. The leaf no longer makes food. 
the green chlorophyll breaks up and disappears. I noticed it's getting darker sooner. So when the weather changes, the leaf can no longer make chlorophyll. And so the chlorophyll disappears and that's when we see the natural colors of the leaves. As the chlorophyll disappears, the other colors show through. The leaf begins to change color. Now the leaf is yellow or orange or red or brown or a mixture of these colors. Look at the leaves falling all around us. See the yellow ones, the orange ones, and all the colors? Now do you think you know why the leaves change color? And Christopher's saying, yes! Let's see if Christopher's got it. Let's hear him explain. When the leaf begins to die, the leaf can no longer make food. The chlorophyll breaks down and the green color begins to disappear. All the hidden colors, the reds, yellows, oranges, and browns, can be seen. Now I know why leaves change color. We do too. Me too. So do I. All right, friends, I hope you can now explain why leaves change color. I want you to go tell a grown-up all about leaves being tiny food factories and making green chlorophyll to cover up their natural colors.